Hey yo, what's up everybody? It's B Milton. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to my second cryptocurrency video. Uh, in my last video, uh, I kind of did a review and in-depth explanation on what KuCoin Exchange is and what KuCoins are and uh, the benefits from this uh, actual exchange uh, for cryptocurrencies. And today I'm going to be going over um, basically my my first good trade that I've made in the cryptocurrency space. Uh, in the past, I've made you know eighty dollars here, seventy dollars here, trading Ethereum on GDAX um, day trading. But I've never really made any you know good big bigger trade uh, for myself. And I'm going to go over that in this uh, today's video. Now let's go over to the actual KuCoin exchange and. Uh, so as you see, uh, I'm here in my assets, and in my last cryptocurrency video where I explained KuCoin and what it is and what all the benefits are of it, um, I showed you guys that I bought uh, roughly like 56 KuCoin for under for like under three dollars, and I I bought that's when I bought in was roughly around under three dollars uh, per KuCoin, and um, I sold that I sold all of that. Um, a, like a week ago or so, and as you know, in this cryptocurrency space, a week feels like a month, and a month feels like a year, uh, just because in, you know, a month's time, so much happens here in this space, and, uh, I actually sold my KuCoin, uh, you know, which gave me, uh, Bitcoin, and I roughly made, uh, around $700 profit. Now, you know, it says, uh, you know, my balance right now is six hundred forty nine dollars USD that's just because uh, Bitcoin has taken a dip which uh, you know hey I'm not worried I'd, I I'm in I'm trying to sit here and think about whether I should buy back into KuCoin or I should just keep the extra Bitcoin that I've made with this initial with this investment with this move that I've made um, knowing that KuCoin was going to go up uh, knowing what they what they offer which is uh, you know they've been adding a lot more coins and stuff like that and then they, uh, I'm just now realizing that they have some coins like uh, Omis, Omis Go, Omis Go, Walton. They're, they have some coins that uh, EOS. They have coins that people want. And uh, although now, right now, KuCoin uh, went up to like twenty dollars, and then now it went back down to like twelve dollars or something like that. Now I'm sitting here wondering whether I should get back into KuCoin uh, because it might go back up. But uh, with this trade that I've made, I've actually, you know, I'm not perfect. I'm still learning in the space. I'm still, you know, evolving. And um, uh, when I sold all my KuCoin, I, you know, I, I wasn't thinking and I should have done the smarter option, which is scale out of it. I should have saved some KuCoin and just, you know, made some profit that I was happy with and, and kept some KuCoin. Because I sold KuCoin at, like I said, I bought it at uh, just under $3. And then it went up to fourteen dollars and fifty cents and that's when I sold all my KuCoin um, you know just because I wanted I wanted more Bitcoin just because uh, Bitcoin is on a huge dip right now and in my personal opinion um, all of these altcoins you know any altcoin uh, that has been doing well I think there's gonna be a time where there's gonna be another flipping where Bitcoin's dominance will rise back again and Bitcoin is king in this space so I didn't feel bad for you know I, I made profit and I made extra Bitcoin and when Bitcoin goes back up to test its all-time highs I, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be profitable again uh, and then in that time where I make more money off of Bitcoin I'll have more money to play around with these uh, other altcoins and I do still have other altcoins uh, don't get me wrong but I have been selling some of my altcoins as they are up uh, just to get more Bitcoin because I feel Sooner it's got to happen. I thought Bitcoin would have uh, flipped and went back up and tested its all-time highs by now, in all honesty. But this space is so um, dramatic. Uh, you never know what's going to happen. But the, the the thing at the end of the day, if Bitcoin does not, uh, if Bitcoin does not go up and, and continue to be the workhorse that everyone wants it to be, all these other altcoins, all these other projects. Everything else besides Bitcoin, all the other cryptocurrencies, they're going to suffer. Um, so we need Bitcoin to lead the way again. When that's going to happen, I'm not sure, but I've, I'm foreseeing it uh, within the within at least a couple months from now. Bitcoin has to go back up and test its all-time highs. 
And then, who knows, uh, as soon as it hits uh, all-time highs and if it breaks through that barrier, uh, we could be looking at huge gains. That's why I am acquiring Bitcoin. That's why uh, even the, the, you know, the, the, the noobis, the, the, the novice mistake that uh, I've made when I, when I sold all my KuCoin and I should have, you know, scaled out. Uh, I, I'm not beating myself up over it. I made profit. I made Bitcoin. Um, now I'm looking at all the other rest of the, uh, the altcoin space. And it's, it is also dramatic. It, you know, things are down. Uh, just yesterday, everything was down except for a few names. KuCoin went all the way up to $20, and now it's back down to $12. I sold it for $14.5. Uh, um, so I am questioning whether I should get back into KuCoin uh, and just save and lock in some of those profits. But um, as I said, we're going to re reiterate it again. Bitcoin is going to, it's it, even even if it doesn't break through the barrier of all-time highs, within the, the near future or just within a, a couple months from now, Bitcoin's going to have to, go up and test the all-time highs at least test it and if not then everyone else is going to suffer from that uh right now bitcoin's got to be the safest investment you can have and uh yeah just wanted to share with you guys my first real good trade i know i can't really show you too much on the screen it's not like i can show you the before and after uh maybe uh so yeah i'm sorry i can't really show you guys like a whole before and after uh if you want to go to my last video where I talk about KuCoin. You can see my assets there and you can see, you know, how much I had. I, I put in roughly $170 and then I made about $700 profit. Um, it doesn't reflect that right now because the, the price of Bitcoin has, uh, you know, plummeted a little bit. Not plummeted. It's just, it's been bouncing around. So uh, I guess I'm going to switch this to, uh, you guys need to check out KuCoin, man. Um, I know that Binance and some of these other exchanges have now let people back in to making accounts and things like that, which that was one of the real reasons why I, I knew uh, KuCoin was going to be a profitable, uh, a, a good place to be. It was because when people couldn't get into Bitrex, when people couldn't get into Binance, uh, they're all going to you know look for somewhere else to go. And this is a good option to go. Uh, the, the, what they're doing over here, and like I said, go check out my, my other video uh, if you don't know much about this exchange I will go in depth and tell you everything you need to know um, but they're adding more coins they got good coins on here um, and yeah basically just check out KuCoin and debate yourself whether you think uh, getting into KuCoin right now at around $12 is worth it uh, seeing that it did go up to $20 not long ago um, and just the entire market has been down within the past day uh, things are rising today but who knows? You could catch uh, KuCoin on a dip right now, and you could ride it back up to $20. Um, who, who knows whether that's going to happen or not? I don't know. I'm debating that myself. Uh, and also, shout out to all the KuCoin you know, people out there who commented on my last video and, you know, talking about some good gains and stuff like that. That's good to know. It's good to know that there's uh, some KuCoin fans and cryptocurrency fans in general finding my videos. Um, I'm going to be doing this more often uh, just because I'm tired of all the, the saturated clickbaity type of um, videos out there in the space that are happening. Uh, so I'll see you guys in the next one. Let me know what, what you guys are doing in the space. Let me know uh, what your best cryptocurrency move was so far. I know I'm just sitting here talking about, you know, $700 gain, um, but I'm sure there's going to be people out there that are watching this video and laugh that off. I'm sure there's people out there that have made tons more than this. But I just want to share with you guys my experience. If you want to share your experience, I would love to read it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.